Hello! In this video, I'll be showing you how I organize my clear stamps and my mounted stamps. So, if you want to see it, please keep on watching! Hello! These are just some of the clear stamps that I will be organizing today. Please forgive my voice being really sick. This storage system was inspired by Jennifer McGuire. And I'm just adapting a little and changing it a little based on the available materials in our country. So here are the materials that we'll be needing. A three ring binder and a cardstock, preferably white. Clear sheet protectors that will fit into your binder. Acetate. And Ziploc bags. I will start with animal themed clear stamps. And here I'm just getting one sheet of the white card stamp. And with the original packaging, I'll just stick it using a glue tape on the top and then stick it onto the white card stamp. And using the protective sleeves, I'll just slide it inside. And then you just put the protective sleeves into the binder. Next, I have here some smaller sets of stamps. I think I can fit two in a page. And I'll just put some Ziploc bag for this one since the plastic is already broken. And you can also use glue dots instead of glue tape in sticking the stamps into your cardstock. So here's what it looks like with two together in a page. For the larger sets, I stick them in the middle of the page. Next, we have the alphabet clear stamps. I was having difficulty using this one since... They're all falling apart, so I decided to remove the acetate with the backing out of the pouch and then incorporate it into this storage system that I made. Let me just arrange this neatly. So we'll just put the backing acetate and put it in a Ziploc bag just in case the letters fall apart again. So I have these two sets of sta stamps in capital letters and in small letters. So I'll stick it two in a page with the help of my glue tape. You can also use this system for the rubber stamps. Here, I cut a small acetate and I just stick the rubber stamps into the acetate. I just stick all the stamps into the acetate one by one. And I just cut another acetate of the same size to be the backing. Let me just show you the close-up. And I just put this in Ziploc bags as well. And our trusty glue tape to help us out. And by now you know the drill. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. How do you store your clear stamps? Please comment down below. So here's a flip through of my storage system for clear stamps and rubber stamps without mounts. Next, I'll be showing to you how I store my mounted rubber stamps. For my mounted stamps, I store them in cosmetics or makeup acrylic drawers. I got this as a gift but I found this online which I will be placing the link down below. So, this is where I put my rubber stamps and clear stamps that are mounted. And some self-inking stamps as well. And that's it! This is how I store my unmounted and mounted stamps. Thank you for watching! Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe!